massive flare up in Telangana's Varangal over the death of the Mira Rakesh. Angry TRS workers staged a protest in Telangana's Varangal over the death of a native named D. Rakesh. D. Rakesh was a resident of Varangal who lost his life in the firing at the Sikandrabad railway station on Friday. A huge mob of angry protesters made an attempt to barge inside the BSNL office in Varangal, chanting slogans. Modi down down. The protesters were also seen damaging billboards and warnings in the area as the police officials tried to control the situation. Meanwhile, cops also largely charged at the protesting students outside the Kakatiya University. Several have been detained. On Thursday, hundreds of protesters stormed the Sikandrabad railway station in a demonstration against the newly announced Agnipat scheme. Now, the fire over the central government's Agnipat scheme has reached Tiruvananthapuram. India Today gets you a report from Tiruvananthapuram where hundreds of army aspirants are gathered outside the Raj Bhavan demanding justice and withdrawal of the Agnipat scheme. Army aspirants are protesting outside Raj Bhavan in Tiruvananthapuram. As you can see, there are hundreds, more than 500 students have gathered outside Tiruvananthapuram. Outside the Raj Bhavan, uh, demanding justice, they started a march from Kampanu to Tirundaram. They crossed Secretariat and they've reached Raj Bhavan now. They have banners asking, conduct army exams. We want justice. We have been preparing for the exams since the last one year. And we need the exams. That is what their main demand is. They're asking for the review and withdrawal of the scheme that was announced. We saw yesterday many such protests taking place in many parts of the country, but in Kerala we did not see anything of such sort. But today morning, many students, many as 500 students, gathered and marched towards Raj Bhavan in Kodikot also. <laughs> So they are saying that since last one day they have been 